you. Hallelujah! And I can praise God about Hallelujah! But there's some things that I just don't know about. That is, you give God the praise on today. And the thing is, is that Pastor, when you said seven was completion, and eight is a new beginning. Yes. Well, today is the last Sunday in this month. Woo! And Woo! Thursday is next month. Oh! So if you're really yes. believing oh, what the word of God walks yes. off in the name yes. of Jesus. Yes. Oh, yes. If you really believe what God said and has been saying for Christian deliverance ministry for so long. Yes. Yes. That when the world came and God spoke on Sunday and not only Sunday but the Sunday before and the Thursday before. I am a good shepherd. Yes. Hope for the hopeless. Yes. All of these words that God has accumulated for this house. Yes. And if you're a visitor on today, well then you're receiving the blessings of God on today. Yes. Because I thought about when I started to work in New Lisbon. And when I started working there, I started in December. But when I started, I came when it was about time for them to get a raise. My first time on a job. And when the state got a raise, because I was there before January, for December the 31st, I got a raise. Thank you. Yeah. You know, that's good. Two weeks that's into the right. job. Yes. And I benefit Two weeks you got a from just being on time. Wow. wow. Being on time. Yes. And some, just like you said, Pastor, some people will probably say, well, you just got here. That's all right. God I was here at the right time. That's right. Yeah. You picked the phone up at the right time. Yeah. You are persistent. Favor. We have to be persistent. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. We yes. can't just give up and say, God, That's right. what's going to happen? you got to believe the word of God. Believe. What God says. Yes. 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 His word is true. Yes. Yes. His word will not return void. Yes. What is your story? All right now. What has God done in your life? What has he brought you out of? Hallelujah. How did he set you up? If I would say, how many of you have been bullied when they were a child? And tell you to raise your hand. <laughs> See, I didn't know you were bullied. <laughs> how many of you might have been homeless? How many of you played sports? Things that I don't even know about you, and I can look at you and say, you play sports? Because my sister, Alicia, when she was talking to me, see what you got to do, you have to have some relationship with people. You got to have a conversation with people to know what they're about. And I was talking to her, and she was telling me all these things about her. And I'm like you said, Pastor, I was looking at the package, like, you like to do that? You like to do that? You like to do that? I'm looking at the, the outside. Didn't know she played the keyboard. You play keyboard? Because I'm, I'm building a relationship. Right. I, I, I want to know about my little sister. That's right. That's right. I want to be able to encourage her in the things that God has given her to do. And that's what we do. Because I don't know your story. You know what God has brought you through. You know what God has brought you out of. Yes. And we're going to be out here real quick. Jesus. And let's turn to Psalms 107. Ooh. Psalms 107. I was so excited, Pastor, this morning. When you said we're going to pray, we, and I knew that there would be some testimonies and that there would be praise in the house. Because God put it in my spirit. And I said, God, I know we're not going to be here long. Because, you know, it's not going to, it's not going to uh, be up to me how long we'll be here today. It's going to be up to you how much praise you're going to give God. Right it's going to be up to you at, in this, this last few days of this month. Whether you're going to God, give God a praise for you coming out and moving over and being transformed into a, another month of new beginnings. And you can't put old wine into new wine skin. Yes, right. So you got to take those things that are behind you and leave them behind you. God is renewing our mind. He is renewing our strength. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Oh, give thanks. Psalms 107. Yes. Oh, give thanks unto the Lord, for he is good. Yes. 
for his, for his mercy endured forever. Let the redeemed of the Lord say so. Are you, are you the redeemed of the Lord? So whom he have redeemed from the hand of the enemy. Have you been redeemed from the hand of the enemy? Do you know what today that you have been, for this season I'll say, you have been redeemed from the hand of the enemy. And gather them out of the lands from the east and from the west, from the north and from the south. They wandered, and you can put your name and you can say, I wandered in the wilderness in a solitary way. I found no city to dwell in. Hunger and thirst, thirsty, my soul fainted in them. Then I cried unto the Lord in my trouble, and he delivered me out of my distresses. And he led me forth by the right way. And it's not saying me, but I'm putting me in there. I'm putting Francine in there. Francine is a redeemed individual. I am free, and who the Son has set free is free indeed. And this is a time, church, for rejoicing. Because it said when you were in distress, you called out. And he delivered you. God has delivered you out of so many places. Yes. So many times. Yes. Over and over and over again. Yes. And then even in this, in this um, scripture, it talks about even in our disobedience. Even in our disobedience when we cried out to God. When he gave us a word and we didn't act on his word. And we were contrary to what he said. But when we cried out to God, he heard us. And he redeemed us and he took us to another place. He showed us the way. Because he is a way maker. Yes, he is. On today, it's up to you, church. Yes. It's up to you to put in your heart, in your mind, in your soul, and in your being that God has delivered you. I'm going to tell you today, God has delivered you. Because when you don't even know you have a broken heart and somebody tells you your heart was broken, and that's not what it might have all boiled down to is that I had a broken heart over all the things, that over all the things that happened, my heart was broken, and the only thing God wanted to do was mend a broken heart. It wasn't about all the other things, Pastor. It wasn't about that story. It wasn't about the stories that I stood up here and told you. It was about the brokenness behind the stories and the things that happened. But I thank God that he's brought me out. I thank God that I'm free on today. I thank God that when I walk into August, hallelujah, I'm already, Pastor, claiming the things that God has for me. I know you have prophesied and said things to me and I've been waiting on them. But I know that the woman of God, the prophetess who spoke, those words are going to come to pass. They are already here. Like she said last week, just put your head, stand at the door. We're out of the fire, church. I don't have any no, another message because I, I can't give you another message because this is where we are right now. Yeah. All right. Because why am I going to give you a message by the last month when God said, you need to praise me. Yeah. You need to praise me yeah. today, not, yeah. not, 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 not wait until right. next week. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Praise me this Sunday yes. on this date yes. in advance yes. for coming out.
going somewhere to bless somebody. Yes. God said, no, I'm blessing you. Amen. Amen. This is a twofold blessing here. Yes, that's it. Because there's something out here that you need. You need some solitude. And I bless God on today because I, 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 the message is going to be any more exciting than you think it is on today. Yes. 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 Any more than you think it is on today. Yes. Because this, everything that has happened here today has been ordained by God. Yes. Your praise has been ordained by yes. God. You have an assignment on today yes. to praise your way out yes. of every situation, yes. everything that you've been yes. through, yes. not everything that you're going through because you're all I tell 
some people, I don't even know what I'm talking about because I really don't know what I'm talking about. But I know on today, the power inside you vested in the God said you're walking across. Yeah. And you're going across the way. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And he's hallelujah. And when that happened, they didn't even know how. Just like he said, they didn't know how, but they trusted God. Yeah. That he parted the waters. That's yeah. right. 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 Ooh, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Hall